Hey everybody, RTX here and welcome back to another video. In this one I am really really excited <laughs> because I found the best freaking aircraft for X-Plane ever. Um, so you see here we're spawned in at this place. Orsta. I, I don't, I don't want to try to pronounce the rest of that. I'm probably going to end up saying something incredibly insulting. Well this is cool, what's special is what's behind me, which is our aircraft for today. Oh, it's, it's way down here. It's this thing. It's like a quadcopter, but you control it. Like, you know, there's the pilot inside. I need to find out how to go slower. So, you know, you can see there's like, you have eight rotors, like two on each uh, little arm here. You can see, and it's got actually a really well-modeled cockpit and stuff. I you know it's not like the best or whatever. Oh, what? Did they just not spin at idle or something? Huh, that's weird. Because they weren't spinning before. I didn't press any buttons and I throttled up. The slightest bit and then they just turn on anywho um our speed is in kilometers which i don't really like um knots would have been a lot more usable or just it's it's easier to i don't know why can't it use knots like every other freaking aircraft so you can see we've got our uh display here that you know shows us all our information that we need we have minus 21 amps and then whops why <laughs> Wops? What the hell? What is a WAP? I don't even know what that says. I think it might be saying watts per hour. This is our battery life or something. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, we've got this box thing here. I don't know what that is. But, oh yeah, we can also open the doors. It has like, uh, like Lambo doors or, uh, I don't know. What's that one like old Mercedes with the gull wing doors? It's, <laughs> it looks so stupid. You know, if you want some air conditioning, well, you don't no no need really. I guess is what I need to say. You don't you don't need it. You just open the doors mid flight. Although I feel like that would almost hit the um the side here, wouldn't it? Or like hit the propellers? I have no idea. Anyway, we're gonna just go ahead and fly now because that's what that's what this is for. So we're just gonna throttle up a little bit. How much throttle do we need to give it to get off the ground? Jesus. There we go. All right. We're flying. We're flying. Oh, my God. This is going to go terribly. This can only go poorly, but that's kind of like the best part about it. We're just going to go full throttle. And then there's some weird stuff going on with the shadows. Let's see how fast we can get this thing going. I got it up to 100 uh, a little bit ago before I, you know, started this, this review or whatever. I don't know what, what this really is. It's just a video on something that I thought was cool. You know, it's got like sounds or whatever. It sounds all right. I think they're just default sounds, but they're not the worst I've ever heard. Um, so if I go ahead and not not um, go to idle throttle right over a gas station, uh, you can actually control the yaw by like, um, what am I trying to say? If you're using like a flight stick, you can twist the uh, thing you can twist this look there's no better wording for that all right anyway yeah you can kind of like twist and you can you know spin around or whatever we're just gonna go fly around for a bit i want to see if we can actually land in this field right here oh my god we are angled down completely we're going about 60 again how do you stop in this thing also going idle throttle is really not a good idea um, wow, it, this thing is really hard to control. I think that's just because I'm stupid. I, dude, I want to land it in the middle of the road. <laughs> As I said before, this can only go poorly. I am... There, you really don't have much control over this. I'm trying, man. I'm trying to get it stopped. I'm going to throttle up. Throttle up. We're going to... Oh, shit. Oh my god. Oh, oh, okay. Just just drop it. Just drop it. Nice! <laughs> this is great! I love this. It's perfect. So yeah, I don't know. It's 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 just cool. It's just really freaking cool. I don't normally like helicopters or whatever, but this is different. This is something else. Uh, this is a unique experience. Oh, I can't stop spinning. Please stop spinning, sir. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh! <laughs> this is such a hellish experience to try and fly. But it's like, it's actually really fun. I feel like if you took the time to get good with this thing, you could actually like do some pretty cool stuff with it. Dude, I want to give it like a bunch of power and make it like a giant racing drone. Oh my God, that would be 
that would make my day. My day has already been made by this. It's kind of fin finicky to uh, get set up and use the first couple of times if you're a stupid idiot yo-ho like I am. Because, you know, I have the throttle bind it to like throttle vertical or some stupid I don't I don't know what it was but it wouldn't let me control the throttle in this thing you know it's just kind of stuck at about half throttle so I need to go ahead and stop we're gonna stop taking off and you know flying this thing around is relatively easy it's just landing it that kind of sucks if you're an idiot we're just gonna descend nice and slowly that's the only option with this thing. Oh, we're falling. Throttle up, throttle up a little bit. Throttle up all the way, all the way, all the way, all the way. Okay, 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 okay. You just need to find find that, that sweet spot. Yeah! I'm a legend. I'm the best at this game. You don't even know. I'm just so good. I'm the best at everything. That's a fat-ass lie, but we're just going to... Just let let me have my fun, all right? Oh, wow. They kind of spin in opposing directions. That's really satisfying to watch. Just go full throttle instantly. <laughs> it just descends. That's the greatest thing. You know, I want to see how high we can actually fly. Uh, the, the website says... I'll link this thing in the, in the description, by the way. Um, the, it says I recommend flying at about 300 to 500 meters above the ground if you could even get that high what's that over there by the way is that like a little racetrack or something huh so yeah they were saying about 300 to 500 meters oh my god what's that <laughs> <laughs> look at the guy in here why is his face so small compared to the rest of his head all right so we're actually going pretty high i wonder if i can put myself out of about sixteen thousand feet let's just see now are we oh we're going up dude what okay now we're not going up oh we are plummeting right now let's do like thirty thousand. can we fly at thirty thousand? i wonder let's let's try that well it doesn't want to Let's see if we can actually make this work somewhat. We are spinning a lot. I am trying to spin though, so let's stop spinning. All right, very nice, very nice. I'm at full throttle right now, by the way, and it's not really, um, not really holding its altitude. So, you know, let's go ahead and just go for a bit of a ride here. See how fast we can actually get this thing going. Let's get a little flyby of this. This ought to be great. <laughs> Look at that. It looks so freaking dumb but it's really cool i love it i want one of these things how much do they cost i need it hold on three hundred thousand dollars you know what? i pay 300 grand for this i see this as an absolute win i think it's awesome i want to Ooh, let's get down like in the valleys kind of and just go a little bit lower but not too low now or else we'll die kind of do some maneuvers around these mountains and stuff See if we can do some some cool stuff. Can we do a barrel roll? Oh, that's not going to work well at all. I kind of want to try it anyway, though. This thing doesn't really like doing flips and stuff, which is, you know, my main issue with it. I just wish it was, you know, more epic and willing to do fun things. Okay, we did that. That was kind of like a corkscrew backflip thing. Also, about the other thing I said, I wish it was, you know more aerobatic or whatever that was kind of a joke you can't really like it's not that's not what this is meant to be especially not in real life i think it's like a taxi or something i have no clue what this actually is but it's freaking cool and i love this thing so much it's just it's something different because you know you get planes and stuff and you get a couple helicopters here and there but you don't get things like this this is something all new we're just gonna you know trim the trees a little bit here oh my god this is how you die cockpit view on this i can't see anything this is awesome i love just flying through trees i should try this in real life and fly through the trees that's gonna go over well Ooh, how does this thing land in the water i wonder oh nope 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 no auto throttle or i idle auto throttle uh what i was trying to say was idle throttle there we go. That's how you words. Not auto throttle. <laughs> I combined like three different things in one there. We're just going to throttle down and uh, fall out of the sky very nicely. 
I wonder if it'll float. I guess that's what I'm trying to figure out. Throttle up just a wee bit. More, 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 more. What? What is this? What a sham. Why is it like jiving about in the water? Why is it doing that? That's weird. <laughs> it's cartwheeling in the water. <laughs> what is this? Oh, I love this. It like mm, gravitates towards the water like a magnet and then it throws itself back up into the air. Dude, if I saw this like in a lake or something or in a river, I would scream and run away. I would be terrified. I mean, it's, <laughs> this is a death machine right here. This whole thing, even if it, in its functioning state, is probably a death machine, to be completely honest. At least in my hands, it is. I don't I don't really know what else I can say about it, other than uh, definitely go check this thing out and uh, let the creator know what a fantastic job they did on this, because this is absolutely awesome. I love this thing. It actually flies really well. I might mess around with it in Plane Maker or something, see if I can give it like 3,000 horsepower and be like a racing drone, because that would be pretty epic. Oh yes, perfect landing. But yeah, we're going to end it off here. I don't really have much else to say. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to drop a like and subscribe if you want. If you don't want to, I don't really care. Do whatever you want. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Until then, have a great one.